Taiwan's TSMC and South Korea's Samsung are reportedly looking to the Middle East to expand their chipmaking operations. According to the Wall Street Journal, top executives from both giants visited the UAE recently to look at possible investments. Taiwan Plus reached out to TSMC for comment. The company says it's always open to discussing how to develop the industry, but says it has no new investment plans at this time. For more on the potential chip opportunities in the Middle East, our reporter Joyce Sun spoke with Dan Hutchinson, the vice chair of the chip market analysis firm Tech Insights. Both TSMC and Samsung are reportedly looking into the United Arab Emirates as a possible place for more chip factories. Do you think that the UAE would be a good investment? The issue for the UAE it comes down to where do they get the labor, the technical uh, side of the labor, as well as where do they get the water? I am not optimistic in such an investment. And because you have to desalinate the water, it's incredibly expensive water. It's like running your fab with Evian water. The one caveat to that is, is that if you go into those countries, what you see is the countries are often running, running with a lot of Indian labor. That is a possibility, especially now that Modi wants to uh, build fabs. The biggest problem is, is it's not the best place to build a factory. They do have one advantage, and that is they have a lot of solar power. But these factories have to run 724, so, you know, when the sun goes down, you, you kind of lose that advantage. We've been following TSMC's ongoing expansion projects in the U.S., Japan, and Germany. What do you see as the biggest challenges for TSMC in terms of additional opportunities for investment? The issue that they face, though, is, is the geopolitical issue of everybody wanting them. You know, they're the prom queen in the semiconductor industry and everybody wants to date them everybody wants to dance with them and they can only have so many partners and at the same time for tsmc you know they're looking to have customers anywhere in the world that will design chips to run on their fabs where their fabs are as opposed to building a fab somewhere so when someone like the uae comes knocking on their door for them it, especially now since they're doing the u.s japan and, and uh, Germany, this is a real challenge for them going forward to start to add other places in, but everybody wants them, you know, and so now they have to play this geopolitical issue of being, being polite and trying to figure out how do they not upset the whole world and make them mad at them uh, and still be a trusted partner.